Hi, welcome to Books with Laura. Today we are going to take a walk through Earth's weirdest, wildest, and most perfectly peculiar plants. It is a book about uh, carnivorous plants and other kinds of things. My son loves Venus flytraps and sundews, and it's a big, beautiful book that I found on Amazon. Um, it's over six, over 60 pages, just about plants. So this um, breaks down different plants. So this is the giant water lily. Then it gives a couple of paragraphs about it. This is a great book to have if you're homeschooling or if you are a teacher. It's a great one to have inside your classroom. Queen of the Night Cactus. So really beautiful illustrations. Here's a sundew, one of the more popular uh, carnivorous plants. It is a cousin to the Venus flytrap. But as I was saying, it has very uh, beautiful illustrations. Just be a lot of reading if you're gonna read this out loud to your kids, a lot of reading. So it'd probably be easiest to just kind of focus on one plant every day or a couple of plants and then go on Amazon and have them look up the plants or if in the case of like a sundew or a Venus flytrap, um, if there's actual videos of um, animals using the plants or getting stuck in the plants, that would also be interesting too. Here's pitcher plants. This is a great high quality book as well. As you can, as you can hear, the pages are very sturdy. It's a great one to have for a library for sure. Living side by side, plants have evolved special relationships with lots of different animals. Um, the animals act as messengers, delivering and collecting pollen for the plant. In return, they get a tasty meal, usually a drink of sweet, sugary nectar. Here's an ant plant. What is this? A tank bromeliad? Oh, a toilet pitcher? <laughs> this is a funny one where they, um, the shrew actually like poops inside the plant <laughs> and that's how it feeds the plant a bucket orchid can plants talk so many interesting interesting information can plants move here's the venus flytrap a squirting cucumber, very interesting. The resurrection plant, an air plant, and protecting plants. And then in the back there's an index, as any proper nonfiction book would do. This book was $17.95. I'll put the affiliate link below for Amazon in case you're interested in purchasing. Thanks for watching. Bye.